There are three things that we all love. Curly, long, and colored hair. And hair like this can be extremely high maintenance. So if you don't know what you're doing with it, it can turn into one huge frizzy mess. So in this video, I'm gonna show you guys how to get results like this by using one simple product that's gonna restore the curl and get rid of the frizz. So if you're interested in learning how, stay tuned. So you first want to fill up your sink with cool water and take one of your favorite shampoos. I am using my Afrogee Curlific, but this is not at all um, needed. You can use whatever you have on hand. Shampoo does not matter. Whatever's going to get the hair clean. And then you're just going to submerge the hair in water and pretty much start your shampooing process. So now I'm just rinsing the hair out with cool water and these are the conditioners that I strongly recommend. I'm using the Pantene Pro-V Curl Perfection, Silicone Mix Original and Silicone Mix Bamboo. I'll leave them all down below so in case you are interested you can pick it up. But I chose to use my Silicone Mix Original this time. It's a really thick consistency. This is perfect for color treated hair damaged hair, hair that's on its last leg, hair that needs to go in the trash like last month. Definitely want to have this in your collection. This really restores the hair and I find that it's perfect for anything that is tangly, high maintenance, curly. Yeah, it melts away the tangles, gets rid of the frizz and makes it shiny and soft and pretty much restores it, okay? So um, after applying it to the hair, I like to do some detangling with a comb as well as my Denman. I know I'm going to get this question, but do I recommend this for synthetic hair? No, synthetic hair is plastic, y'all. This ain't going to work. You can try it. I haven't tried it, but I'm not sure if it's going to work, okay? So sorry, guys. But I'm just now um, allowing the hair to pretty much penetrate in a bag. So um, I, allow, I allowed it to sit in the bag for maybe like, I think an hour, maybe a little longer, but you don't have to let it sit for that long, okay? And this is the way the hair looks. Now, again, I'm just going to rinse it with cool water. You do not want to use hot because hot makes it frizzy, okay? So cold water, and I like to kind of squeeze the water out gently. You don't want to do too much squeezing because you don't want it to frizz up, okay? But this step is completely optional. I like to use like a lightweight oil or a serum and take like a pump of it and just put it on the parts that are the most dry. So if you have colored hair, put it on the colored part. If you have extremely like dry, tangly hair, put it all over, okay? But when drying your unit, you want to refrain from putting a curl pattern like this on a mannequin because it's just going to turn wavy. You want to scrunch the hair so that it becomes more voluminous and curly, okay? But anyways, you guys, this unit comes from divaswigs.com. This is their virgin Brazilian ombre curly. I'll leave all the information down below. Here are some things that came along with my hair. Um, a necklace and a wig cap. And it also came with like a little brochure, okay? But anyways, um, this is the hair, right? Some of you guys are gonna ask how long it took me to get my hair. You guys, whoa. It took me like three months to get it. I don't know if they forgot, but it took me three months and this was sent to me to review, okay? So you guys wanna be aware of that, okay? But this is their full glueless lace wig. It does come with some combs as well as adjustable straps in the inside part. And I'm just gonna put the wig on like I always do. You guys know. It's really redundant. I always feel like I sound like a broken record, okay? <laughs> but um, yeah, I'm just gonna go ahead and, well, this is the texture, okay? Again, you guys, that silicone mix really brought out the curls. My hair is completely restored. If you use this, you will love it, I promise you, okay? So yeah, as I do in all my videos, I like to take my LA Girl Pro Concealer and place that in the parting space. A lot of you guys wanna know what color I use. I do believe this is toffee, if I'm not mistaken. As well as I like to set that concealer with a little powder. I'm using my MAC Mineralize Skin Finish in dark. And I like to just place that on top of it and it pretty much sets it, okay? So this is the way the front perimeter of my hair looks like. I'm okay with it, it's looking pretty good. But now I wanna add some volume, so I'm using my Y2 
comb and just gently pulling from the roots just to get it to look a little more voluminous and I know a lot of you guys are going to be like what is the length that you have the original length of this hair was 22 inches long and I did not like it it was way too much hair it was way too much ombre and it was just way too long so I cut it I will leave a little video right here showcasing the process of me cutting it but I am loving the way it looks now it's really reminding me of like natural Nisi before she cut her hair but yeah I love it but anyways you guys this comes from divaswigs.com and I do have a coupon code that I will leave down below for you guys let me know what you think and I'll catch you guys later bye guys